A report from the Western Province on exploitation of marine resources there at a frightening rate. Small industries involved in harvesting them have expressed concern over poaching. Norin Dada visited Daru and filed this report. You'd be forgiven if you asked what else is there in Western Province apart from the Octeri mine. If it weren't for the basic fact that it's inhibited, one can easily forget that this place exists. Let's face it, if nature wasn't so harsh on PNG's biggest mine forcing its partial closure, and that tuberculosis was rattling fear into the fabric of society, then what would illegal fishing mean? Apparently it would mean a lot, but that part of Western Province rarely isn't publicised. Maru Marine is a nationally owned company nestled at Daru waterfront's fringes and has been churning out marine favourites as the provincial icon Baramandi and the now lucrative and very much export worthy crayfish. At the moment, the best price offered for crayfish is $69 to $70 a kilo. From humble beginnings 10 years ago, Merimi Miner's Maru Marine has earned its place in fisheries development in PNG, particularly Western Province, and not only provides much needed employment opportunities for locals, but also aligned itself with the National Fisheries Authority to participate in sustainable fishing practices. But if it's one rift that sets a divide between the two, it would be that of the serial continuation of unregulated, illegal beach demer fish in the province. The hookah season is always every year from April to end of December, end of November. Uh, apparently, my loft of fishermen are protest, protesting against the closure of hookah season because NFA has taken negative attitude towards continuous harvesting of bestima in Western Province. And bestima fishing is not by, done by the treaty villages. It's done by people who are immigrants into Daru. Hookah allows for the use of artificial breathing apparatus for a period between 30 minutes to an hour underwater and it's a method local fishermen widely use to supply lobster to Maru Marine. Add a ban to its use, like what's currently imposed by the NFA for Western Province and Torres Strait waters, and it's a recipe set to turn sour. Because this fishing is now done by everybody. Even though you go to the reef now, you will see everybody walking day and night looking for best man. It's totally out of control now in Western Province. Mr. Merimi Maina has written to both police and the National Fisheries Authority. They have yet to receive and respond to claims of poaching. This has been PNG Tonight. If you would like to comment or provide information or feedback on any of our stories, please visit our website at pngtonight.com. We'll do it again at the same time tomorrow night. Good night.